What's up, hunting fam? I'm Matt Dre, and this is DOD TV. DOD team member Cody Sherrick tries to close the book on a Nebraska giant. The Gate 8, Ed Strom, or Junkie, they've all been coming through here. It is November 6th. You don't know what you're going to pick up, what you're going to see. So hopefully I can make it happen solo filming. Got four tactic cams out, rolling. Hopefully uh, seal the deal here this evening. After a disappointing miss on his target buck called the Gate 8, Cody gets a shot at redemption as his second target buck, Junkie, enters the scene. Cody, looks like Lady Luck is on your side. This episode of DoD TV is brought to you by the incredibly durable Morel Shooting Target. With many designs available, you're sure to find a target that fits your practicing style. I was bummed and I calmed myself down. It's November 6th, anything can happen, anything can show up. So I sat back down, regrouped, refocused on what I was doing, and lo and behold, I turned behind me, Junkie was on the side hill about 350, 400 yards, directly downwind of me with a doe. I knew he heard me, he's a very aggressive deer, so that's why I was not afraid to call at him and be really aggressive. So he worked away from me, but towards me. He basically worked down to the bridge, jumped the fence, and got on some block of oak trees. I just spotted a big buck junkie, but I lost him by the, just before he got to the bridge. There he is, there he is. So this is a Morel high roller. And uh, I think one of the things that is appealing to me about Morel in general is how they're leading the industry in technology. Everything they do makes them that much better than the competition. And to think that they're doing it all here in the United States of America, just like they have been since 1986, that's impressive to me. I love this high roller target because of the arrow removal. This is the third season now with this particular target. I take it with me wherever I go. I shoot before I hunt. I make sure that I pound it every single day and it's got all the different uh, sides, 21 different targets to shoot at. I really, really like this particular target. Number one, because it's small, it's portable. Also that size, especially when you get to a distance and you're shooting at it, it makes you that much more accurate. So the high roller from Morel, check it out. American made for 30 years. Yes, yes, baby, yes, oh, oh, oh. I think I smoked Junkie, I think I smoked him, I don't know, oh, oh. it sounded like a good hit, I gotta review the footage, I hope, I, I, the way my luck's going, I, I, I don't know, I, I just don't know, I think so, I think it's good, I, got, I, I gotta review the footage. Oh my, so much hard work. That was fun. You know, from such a high of getting gate eight coming in and 
he was my number one hit list just gate eight was just because of the history i've had with them i think junkie's way bigger but uh, then missing missing the gate eight at 20 yards and then lo and behold have junkie show up two or three hundred yards away grinding him don't bleed him all the way in <laughs> give me a 35 yard shot i mean it went through both shoulders and he took off running on a tail between his legs so thank you god thank you i lost my mind on this i mean i was cheering i was crying i mean the emotions just flooded out on me that's what deer hunting is about so is that that's what gets me up at two in the morning to get to the property three hours before daylight. So, I mean, it was just a whirlwind of a day. And the, the Rage Hypodermic. This one right through the shoulder. Caught him on film coming out this way. Oh, baby, right here. Holy moly. Oh, holy buckets. That's a giant, man. That is a giant. Well, what an amazing day. I had a buck that I've been after gate eight come by and guess what i choked i missed a 20 yard chip shot and later on this guy shows up about 300 yards behind me and i grunted dope bleeded and lo and behold he works his way in all the way in took a half hour to get to me 35 yard shot with a psc and rage found its mark he went 65 yards and he is a giant he is a stud for here in nebraska i am excited i am thrilled i am blessed the highs and the lows of hunting all in one day, in and with a high, that's how I like to roll. And he's a seven year old giant. And he's a seven year old giant. <laughs> We're adding new videos every week, so make sure to click that subscribe button and check out all of our amazing content. This episode of DOD TV was brought to you by MOTV. For full episodes of Critical Mass and all of our outdoor channel content, head over to the MOTV app and view it today.